Hey Patty, I know one of your rules is that men should initiate all dates before monogamy, but if you like a guy, it's hard not to ask him to do something together. Should us women really just sit back and wait for the men to make all the moves? Good question, actually. Um, if you're in a situation like you're working for a charity, you've got events going on in your life, you can ask someone to pal with you. But the truth of the matter is he's always going to remember that you initiated. So I have to go with the man. If he likes you, he's going to ask you out. You know? It's the old school philosophy. What's the number one thing people do wrong? Oh, God. The number one thing that they do wrong, I think, is they assume someone likes them when they don't. And I get a lot of that. Like, yeah. oh, he really liked me, he really liked me. And I'm like, no, he didn't. He's not calling you. And you'll wait two weeks, and you'll just be like, oh, he's busy. He's doing something else. He's not into you. Next question. Hi there, Patty. Uh, I'm a high school student, and right now this formal season. So my question for you is this. Should a guy be paying for everything when it comes to dances? Like flowers, tickets, dinner? What are your thoughts? Thanks. Yes. I'm Jewish. Yes, yes, yes. If you can't afford all of it, do a little bit of it. You know? Manage it. Yeah, manage it. I mean, you can take it down a level. You don't have to get the limo, and you don't have to, you know, go big deal on the flowers. One little corsage is not going to cost that No much. such thing as Dutch treat. Yes, no. Not on prom night. Mm -hmm. It's, it's going to be the night that you're going to want to score. If she pays for it, she's not going to give it up anyway. People score on prom night? Yes. That's where they, remember in the old days, like when I grew up, you went down the shore, you know, you spent the weekend with him. It was a big deal. You're kidding. No. That's people did that, right? I was lucky I got a date.